Is it just me or is our culture draining the life out of families? Hi, I'm Dave Stone, author of the new book series, Faithful Families. And I am passionate about helping parents improve the relational and spiritual climate in their home and on their family tree. In a world of electronic devices and hectic schedules, families are suffering. Delight has been deleted. Joy and fulfillment have been replaced by worry and hurry. I think one of the main challenges that I have found is trying to live a slow-paced life in a fast-paced world. Oh my goodness, what am I going to do? Um, if you're a single parent, you're thinking, how am I going to raise this child? What am I supposed to do? You know, in that stage where our kids are pushing their limits and stretching their bounds, um, you know, you balance that feeling of they're the greatest thing since sliced bread and you want to throw them in a trash can all at the same moment. So, Whether you have teens or toddlers, none of us are perfect parents. I make plenty of mistakes. God's more concerned with your direction than He is your perfection. The first two books in the Faithful Family series, Raising Your Kids to Love the Lord and Building Family Ties with Faith, Love and Laughter, will both encourage and challenge you with proven principles and practical real-life stories from my home and plenty of others. When you, when you read through Dave's book, you realize you got a limited amount of time. You may have to put a career or the desires of your own heart on hold. If you are consistent and faithful, that you will reap that harvest later of them honoring God. The thing I love from the start with Dave's book is just so many examples, not just from his family, but other Christian families of practical things that people do all the time at different ages and a variety that you can pick from what works for your family. Providing a united front is so important and imperative because the kids, like the books say, they can, they can see a kink in the chain. And so what we do is, you know, we'll allow that parent to parent, you know, in front of the kids and then I'll take Lance back to the room and <laughs> tell him what he did. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty easy to raise kids who are aimless, joyless, and Christless. Simply get in line and follow the crowd. But if you want your family to be distinctive, joyful, and godly, you'll have to be intentional. Do it now. The best time to plant an oak tree was 25 years ago. The second best time is today. If I were to describe the Faithful Families book series in one word, it would be the word reassuring. Be practical. Life preserver. Refreshing. I would also say um, honest. Encouraging. I'd love to encourage you through faithful families. Become a positive and practical parent. 